Hi everybody, this is Joel from spotterhome.com and Spotterhome Paris. Today we're seeing a very nice studio in the 19th arrondissement of Paris, which is in the northern part of the city. Uh, this is uh, quite central, this is really easy to get to. There's a lot of subway lines, also a lot of buses, and this is actually an amazing place to live in because there's everything, all the amenities around here, all the grocery stores and uh, all the shops like, uh, you know, boucherie and bakeries, French bakeries, you can get a French baguette, like, just around the corner, obviously this is Paris, you know it. And just uh, across the street, there's this wonderful park. So it's, it's a really, really great park where you can go for a run if you want, or just chill in the summer, like on a nice day like today, it's really great. The flat is on the eighth um, floor of this building. It's kind of like an older building, I'd say maybe beginning of the last century or something. And uh, there is actually an elevator, so that's that's good for you know when you live on the eighth floor. And the flat is a studio, as I mentioned, with a separate kitchen. Give you a tour. But let's just start with the beginning. This is the door and it's very secure. There's a three point lock door with this. I don't know what you call it. You know, it's for when you open, you can check who's, uh, who's knocking on your door before you fully open the fully open it so let's start so this is the corridor with the with the entrance corridor there's the um, the storage room here it's like kind of like the wardrobe if i you know if i if i, if I may say so uh, it's styled up there's the phone plug on here and it's really i mean it's really straightforward there's the bedroom slash living room here since studio there's the bathroom here and there's the kitchen here let's start on the left with the kitchen uh, on the kitchen you see the floor is tiled up as well it's all the different tiles though it's uh, more, I th I'd say it's more appropriate for a kitchen. And um, it's, I think it's rather big. Um, at the moment, the flat is, uh, is inhabited, is occupied. So there's a lot of stuff here. You, you know, you have to just like, kind of like look, um, not look at that and just see the, the flat for what it is. So the flat is fully equipped. Um, here you get the fridge with a freezer compartment here. There's a microwave oven. Um, there's an oven as well, slash grill. There's a coffee machine, a kettle, there's gas. You can see it's gas hub. For those of you who like to cook, I think gas the one. I mean, electric, electric is like, you know, really convenient and all that. But for those who really like to cook, I think gas heat is the one. So there's the um, wooden, um, sorry, top, top, uh, top of the kitchen. Top, how do you call it again? Sorry, the work surface, that's it. The wooden work surface is like massive wood. It's really, really good quality. Um, and if you, you know, you can renovate it. Like you can like, you can like renovate it completely. So that, that's a good thing with wood. Uh, there's a sink as well here. Uh, there's tiles on the walls. There's a couple of shelves right here. Uh, there's this as well. You can hang stuff like you, you like so, chopping boards and uh, knives and everything. Uh, there's a washing machine in here. Didn't mention that, did I? And here you get the drawers and couple um, cupboard sp space with like in it you get like uh, salad bowls and plates um, and, and everything like even oven oven dishes here you get frying pans and saucepans and here I guess all the cleaning products and the bin if you want like hang to the door so that's it you get a, f a double window as well here the, the whole flat is really bright you can see as well that the, the, the windows are PVC double glazed um, the view is on a kind of a small courtyard, I'll show you a bit later. So it's really quiet anyway. So you get a table made of kind of stone, I think it's natural stone, I wouldn't say marble, but some kind of natural stone with a couple of chairs. And, um, and the, yeah, there's a heater as well. The heating is central, so that's really included in the charge, charges, sorry, that's really, really good. So you get a lot of, uh, you know, you don't really uh, pay a lot for that because it's all included. So this is the bathroom. The bathroom is, re I think it's, it looks really, really nice. I mean, it's bright, look at that. There's just one window here, but it's really placed at the right, um, you know, it's really well uh, placed because it, it lets up all the room easily. You get this nice wooden uh, kind of table where you get a sink, uh, not a sink, but a basin, sorry. A basin laid on top of it. And there's a nice and, and big mirror with tiles, decorative tiles and the light is on top of it, so when you turn the light on, oh, actually this light doesn't work apparently, probably interchangeable, but there's another light here. There is a bathtub as well, which is really good, I think, in a, in a studio, you usually get like a tiny shower, here you get a full-on bathtub, so there's a toilet in here as well, another heating device. Uh, with all those heating devices, I'm pretty sure it's not, you can't be cold here in the winter, I mean, 
here is um storage space it's uh well i'm gonna show you but you know keep in mind it's occupied at the moment i have to show you because it's really deep there's a lot of space in there so you have to see it there's a hanger space and here there's a shelf it's really really deep you can put like a full-on suitcase in there easily and there's a lot of shelves as well in the back over there so and obviously you can hang stuff on the door like so last but not not least this is the main room um which you know doubles up as a living room and a bedroom uh you can see the floor is uh, made of wood it's wooden it's kind of like really it looks like you know older wood i think the one that that's the one i prefer because it's really warm and it's not as synthetic as the new ones and you know it's kind of like you don't really get wood like that nowadays unfortunately it's really good quality feels really warm so there's another heating device in the corner over there there's a double uh window right here and i said that i was going to show you the kind of like the view it's not really the view but the, um basically it's kind of like a courtyard it's not directly the street the street is over there but it's kind of like a dead end so there's no, no not really a lot of cars that go here so that's really quiet and um and yeah so and on top of that obviously you get blinds but once you close everything it's really well isolated you can't hear anything i mean there's nothing to hear in the first place because it's quiet but you know you can't really it's really quiet anyway that's that was my point sorry long point but i got there in the end so there's a chair here there's a kind of like a double kind of like a little sofa really um like really really cool style actually it's kind of like olden style made of wood here um there is a couple coffee tables here those are separate you know it's like one and two tables and there's a nice wooden table here round table with another chair here that you can use um for dinner table i guess if you wanted to the, the flat screen tv is not staying and i think that isn't either uh, there's a bed here it's kind of like a, um, a single bed but it's not like it's not the smallest one it's like it's like in the middle it's not a double bed but it's not a small single uh well you get my point you see it anyway it's um let's call it a big single bed right <laughs> if you agree with that and there's another bed here but um in the corner but i don't know you know you can put it in the cupboard if you don't want it or do what you know put it there if you if you want to if you want to have like a big bed if you wanted to so okay that's it i think i've covered everything except for that lamp there's a lamp here as well and uh, yeah now i've covered everything thank you for watching guys this was joel from spot home paris and spot see you soon bye bye